Okay, and I'm back, so took a little bit of work, but I finally got it all mapped out. It's pretty much all the dirt in this area is where the sugar cane's going to go, while the ice is going to be melted and covered up in wooden planks. And then this is going to be the basic shape of the place. It's going to have a roof and everything so that it doesn't melt, or so that the ice doesn't freeze and all. So it's going to take a little bit of time, so I'm going to need to get some more wood, and in order to do that, I'm going to need to get more bones. So in the next couple of episodes, I'll probably just be in the bone farm quite a bit, getting some bones. And I also may do that off camera a bit. But as you can tell, I made a bit of bread because it heals more than donuts, I believe. So that's just about it for this episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. So thank you for watching. If you have any more challenges for me to do, including Better Than Wolves mod, or maybe if you have another mod that you guys think I should try out, Suggest it, I'll look at it and all, and if I like it, I will probably consider using it as a mod in the series. Be careful though, it has to be something that a laptop can handle, and what I mean by that is just it can't be that resource demanding. And there's the phone again. So, thank you guys for watching, hope you enjoyed. And don't forget, check out Rise, there will be a link in the description to the main hub of it, that's basically Rise Station, it's where some of the main videos will get uploaded by the owners and other really good videos and stuff. But I'm the head content manager, so I just manage all the content manager people. But I'm mainly uploading it to Rise Shooter, so that's where all the shooter stuff is. So be sure to check it out. If you guys like Minecraft, then check out another one called Rise Dungeon. So thank you guys again for watching. I hope you enjoyed. See ya. Bye. Hey guys, what's up? Do 50 Blaze here for next episode of Survival Archipelago. Got a bit of a headache and all. So may... well say ow a couple times or something. I don't know why it's laggy every time I start this. But yeah guys, so I decided what better way to spend my weekend than trapped on an island. So let's record some survival archipelago. Hmm. So first off, let's just recap what happened last time I recorded, which is that I finished up getting all the stuff I need for the windmill. Which means I can get the windmill built. Man, I need to build a sugar cane farm. I'll build it out of wood just because I'm too lazy to build it out of anything better. After all, I got trees and stuff. But then, in order to build the windmill, I'm going to have to build it out of cobblestone just because, I don't know why, why not, you know. But now I think of it, I need to get the stuff in order to build the cobblestone. Oh yeah, it's open up better than wolves. I cannot forget that. But yeah, in order to get the... Holy crap, social blade looks different. Yeah, sorry about that. But... Just opened up my thing, and Social Blade is one of the bookmarks, and I just saw that it actually shows the knife going into the earth this time. But yeah, now I've got Better Than Wolves open, so I need to remember how to make those gearboxes and stuff. Of course, 1.3 comes out on, I think it's Tuesday, so I'll be able to, well, do some new stuff. Okay, so I need axles, which I need hemp to make. Because I need to make the rope. Frick. And eh, that'll take a while, so I'll just close that for now. I got some fibers. I memorized pretty much how to make them. That do, do I? Nope, I do not have a... Oh, wait, yeah, recipe book. That'll be useful. Let's be gone. So, what else can I make right now? Oh, yeah, sugar cane. Let's go get some sugar. Wait, do I? Oh, yeah, axe. Got a wood cutting axe. I'm gonna need a bucket. Hmm. Man, don't you guys just like hate it when you get a headache though? Like, you know, one of those ones where you have to like rub the temples of your head and all, and that kind of helps, but it doesn't really help too much. Stuff. You know, some of you probably know what I'm talking about. Some of you have no idea. You probably think, "Wow, he's an idiot." Sounds stupid. Ooh, a gunpowder. Hmm. When I was planning for this video today, I thought of something gunpowder will be useful for, but now I can't remember. Okay, so it's good for TNT, but other than that is... Oh, wait. Oh, now I remember. I was planning on using the gunpowder to make mine. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm going to need some wood. So let's put all that in here. Now let's make... One, two, three, four, five, six. Boom. Probably should get some glass, too. So... Let's go to the island over here and steal some sand. So guys, um, 
Don't forget to check me out on Rise. It's a new network that was just started. Frick, that's dirt. Be gone, you evil dirt. But yeah, Rise is a new network started probably towards the beginning of this month. I've made a series called Zombie Survival Guide. I've made a couple videos on it so far. Making my third coming out tomorrow. And it is what the name would imply. Pretty much a guide on how to survive and thrive in Nazi zombies on Black Ops and World at War. And I usually record in World at War or Black Ops just because it's easier to get into matches that aren't hacked. But it's still pretty good. So like, you know, I bring up some tips on Modern Warfare or not. Bleh. Okay, where the heck did I get Modern Warfare from? Just now. Wow, I really need to start thinking ahead. Let me just clear my mind for a moment. Okay, and get some eggs so I can make more food. You don't screw all you chickens. Aha. Now you are out. Now slaughter. Slaughter. Yeah. Okay, so. Pretty much I will mention some tips for Modern Warfare. Bleh. Bleh. I mentioned tips for how to play in World at War, despite the fact that I don't record in World at War anymore, just because it's really crappy gameplay when all that you can get into game with is hackers. So, you know. Plus, of course, World at War you cannot hoard in too easily, while Black Ops, that's pretty much like the main strategy, no matter what game you're in. Frick. Be gone, cheapy. So, yeah, pretty much that's how I record it and all. So, let's Go back to my house. Or right, you know what? First, let's cut this sugar cane down. Now let's come here and ah, get a bit more sand. There we go. Now let's put all this in the furnace. Then I'll start getting more wood so I can start building the sugar cane farm right over there. So let's see. We got 64, 64. Oh, wait, did I even sleep yet? In this world, let's sleep. Just in case. And my head is still killing me. So let's see. Give that time to smelt, and in the meantime, I'll get some wood. Let's see now, I may need some bone meal. Do I have any bones? That's odd. No bones. Oh well. So now we got an axe. Timber mod will make it really easy and quick to get some wood. Like so. Let's go check on the wolves. See, guys, apparently the Olympics is starting. Probably started already, like, yesterday, I think it was, or so. I don't really watch the Olympics. I'm not a big fan of... Ooh, I got some crap. But yeah, I'm not a big fan of sports, so I don't really follow that sort of stuff too often. So let's see now. We got crap, which means we can get some... Cook... No, wait. If I put it in a cauldron... And it cooks it. Yeah, let's make some bone meal. So yeah, Better Than Wolves has its own way of making bone meal. So let's just do this. Put this in here, replant it. And then put that in there. I'm missing something. Can't remember how you make donuts. Time to open up the thing again. But yeah, I don't really follow too much of the Olympics. So, you know, that could be better. Let's see now, um, lines. But yeah, because of the Olympic stuff, I just ignore it and all. I'm not a big fan of sports in general. I play some of them sometimes. Like, I enjoy football, two-man touch style, because I'm really small. Or at least compared to everyone else. But at the same time, I don't really watch it too much. I'm not a big fan of, like, MLB. I love MLG, but not MLB. Don't watch it ever. Don't follow it. Whatever. So let's see. Cauldron. Hmm. Donuts, um, donuts made by cooking flour in a stone pot produce four for every unit of wheat. See, that should work. Hmm. 
I wonder if it has to be a stoked flame. Huh. Let's see now. Let's just use my magical recipe book. Let's see if it has anything to say about this. Hmm. Blood wood, that would be useful. Okay, so apparently dung functions as a dye. Although I don't really imagine anyone ever wanting to use that. Hmm. Let's see now, what else is there? Wait, what is that? Tuning fork. No idea what that's for. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, there goes my phone right next to me. Put that over away from my arm. I give up. Yeah, so it says that the stewing pot like says that all you need to do to make the donuts is put the don the wheat into the cauldron. But it's not doing anything. Yeah, maybe I do need more wheat. And in the meantime, let's just get more wood. Like what the original plan was. Because I can get more food some other way. Like, let's get back in here and see if I have any more dung. Nope, no more. Wait, that's the chicken. I need the chicken. We got an egg. Rawr. Now let's just breed these two chickens. Right there and there. Now let's come over here. Put that in there. Now we put that in there. Should become spoiled. Hopefully I don't lose the dung. And hopefully it doesn't like explode and smell. There we go, foul food. Now it should act as a fertilizer. Nope. All it does is let me eat it. Let's see if I can use it. Hmm. It's gonna control F, foul food. Yeah, it just says it's what happens when you dump dung into a stewing pot. Maybe eaten, but it's not exactly f good food. So let's try searching fertilizer. Let's see now, there's only one time that it says it. There's only one time everything appears. Ugh. It's like the whole mod's changing on me. I wonder if dunk can be used as a fertilizer. Nope. Great, now what the heck am I supposed to do with it? Oh wait, maybe my wolves can eat it. it sounds disgusting, but it's possible. What else am I going to do with that anyways? Nope, they don't want it. Screw it, you can eat it. I don't want it. Hmm. Oh, an apple. Okay, so the hemp has grown up a bit. Let's put that in there. Take that run over here. Jump up here. Put this in here. Put that in there. Put that in because I don't want it. And now we got the glass. Let's go get more seeds. Oh wait, I just remembered my bone farm. Now let the stupidness be felt.
Wait, I think it's a rotten flesh farm. Stand on here. Yep, it's a rotten flesh farm. Let's see now, so skeleton. Boom. 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 Now let's watch the magic happen. And wait. And wait. And wait. And wait. And of course we can wait some more. Come on, Mr. Zombie. Dang it, why won't he die? Now it seems like it doesn't want to spawn anything right now, so I'll just go back and get some stuff, and then I can just get them spawned off camera at some point. But yeah, in the next couple of episodes, I probably should get some TNT made in the cauldron to blow up some stuff down near bedrock so I can make some redstone stuffs. And I'm back up here, so no hemp, wheat. Let's see if this wants to work now. Or not. Ugh. Oh, no, wait, now I remember what it is. I have to grind it up first and make flour. Forgot about that. And now, boom, flour. Put that in there. There we go. Yeah, I could have swore that foul food could be used, though, as a fertilizer. Control F, bone, and meal. Oh, well. And there we go, four donuts. More hemp. Now let's bring these over here. Okay, there has to be some sort of actual use, though, for the hemp. Or not, wait. There has to be some sort of use for the foul food. Like, I'm pretty sure there's some way that you can use it that's actually useful. And I wonder if maybe too many items has something to remind me about. So we got... Hmm. Where is all the items? There we go. Dung. All food. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that foul food could be used as that. Eh, what are you going to do? There we go. So let's see. I have no armor, so might as well wear that. Put the saplings back, because I don't have any use for them. It's almost daytime, or nighttime. Cut down you. And I guess it's a good time now to start working on this... Hmm. So let's just cover this up. So for now I just... Yeah, I should probably get some dirt. That'll be useful. Ooh, more wood. And there we go. Hey guys, I just remembered also. Um, not only is Rice Station, like, a good idea to check out, and, like, just see how we're doing so far, see if there's any directors that you're interested in watching. But also, consider maybe checking it out and actually applying for a directorship, because we are looking for directors right now with a lot of promise and stuff, because we don't have too, too many yet. Like, we have a few, but we don't have as many as we'd like to have in the future, so it's a good thing to consider checking out. So let's just... Two, 
three, four. So now I figured I'll just map out the sugar cane. Yeah, let's do that. You know, yeah, this is gonna get boring. So pretty much, I'm just gonna do this sort of pattern, like one, then around it two rows of four, and then just gonna do that a few times. So I'm just gonna map it out real quickly off screen. I'll be back when I'm done.